M1 Global presents. Уважаемые поклонники смешанных боевых единоборств, продолжается M1 Challenge 86, битва нартов. Мы в Назране, дворец спорта Магаз. И вот следующие герои этой битвы. Hello, my name is Alexi Mandukivi. I'm from Helsinki, Finland. I'm 23 years old, fighter. It's my first fight for M1 Global. It's nice to be here, nice weather here, pretty warm. Uh, I'm fighting against Basir Gagiev. Uh, he seems to be pretty good in all around, but I don't think he has uh, any weapons against me. Basir Gagiev, Basir School Perzi. Поступаю на М1 Челлендж 86. Бью с Финном Алекс... Алексей Мантукиви. Хороший боец, с хорошим рекордом. Дрался с хорошими ребятами. Его сильные стороны это ударная база, ударный класс. Слабые стороны борьба. I haven't seen uh, many of his fine fights. I found two, and he seems to be a good grappler, but not, that's not going to be a problem to me. In principle, you can fight with him, and then you can go and the fight. My game plan is going to uh, keep the fight on stand and uh, going to punch him in the face and kick him in the leg. Каждый бой важен, каждый бой хочется выиграть. Тем более у себя дома, перед земляками, перед родственниками, друзьями. Поэтому сделаю все возможное, чтобы порадовать всех. Basir, you need to be ready because I am ready. And after the fight, when I have won by knockout, I'm going to eat a lot of ice cream. Алекс, ты хороший боец, но на этот раз ты проиграешь. Уважаемые господа, представляем вашему вниманию трехраундовый супербой в легком весе. В седьмом гурейче спортсмен из Финляндии. Встречайте Алексей Мантукиви. From Finland, Alexi Mantukivi enters this his M1 debut with a pro MMA record of 10 wins, 4 losses. Mantukivi in outstanding form, victorious in six of his 11, in six of his last seven fights with five finishes over that span. In our fighter meeting yesterday, Mantukivi told me that he wants to stay on the outside with his striking, definitely avoid the clinch. He said, I want to throw a lot of straight punches and a lot of low kicks from outside range. Matt Tukivi also said, my goal is to keep this fight standing, keep it in the center of the M1 ring, and do not let Bashir Gagiev get into a rhythm.
Спортсмен в Красном Гурыдже представляет Российскую Федерацию, Республику Ингушетия. Вы готовы? Встречайте! Башир Гаги! The Russian Bashir Gagiev from Ingushetia. His pro MMA record stands at five wins, two losses, and a perfect 2-0 and in M1. Both of those victories by way of first round TKO. Gagiev said that he wants a very fast start, close the distance, Amantu Kivi quickly, heavy inside pressure. Gagiev also told me that he feels that he is much more of a power puncher, a power kicker than Mantu Kivi. He said, I want to land big shots from close range. So often, a fight is about range. Mantu Kivi wants to be on the outside. Gagiev wants to be on the inside. Tremendous atmosphere here tonight at Sport Palace in Ingushetia, Russia. M1 Challenge 86. Very pleased that you're with us watching globally on television, online, m1global.tv. Let's go back to Ian the Machine Freeman to get us started with this lightweight bout. Ladies and gentlemen, this is an M1 Challenge bout in the lightweight division. Now introducing your fighter in the blue corner. This fighter is 24 years old. He weighed in at 70.3 kilograms. He stands 175 centimeters tall and has a record of 10 wins with only four losses. He is Kerlia fight champion and fight night champion from Finland, Alexi Mantokivi. And now welcome his opponent in the red corner. This fighter is 33 years old. He weighed in at 69.8 kilograms. He stands 177 centimeters tall and has a record of five wins and two losses. He is Eurasian Pancration champion and national complex fight champion from the Republic of Ingushentia, Bashi Kagiyev. And the referee of this bout, Ukas Posatsky. Alexi, Russian. Okay, fighters, no the rules. Listen to my commands all the time. When I say stop, be stopped as goes. Go back to your corners. In the lightweight division, Alexi Mantukivi versus Dad. Bashir Gagiev. Ready? Ready? Fight. Round number one. Both fighters in black trunks, blue glove tape for Mantu Kivi, red glove tape for Gagiev. Oh, nice double leg, timed up beautifully. On the blast double, beautiful shot indeed from Gagiev. Triangle attempt, nice pass, beautiful pass in fact. Hooking the near side leg, in the full cradle. Gagiev, very clever on the ground. You see the spin, Mantukivi trying to get back to his oh, feet. Oh, great work, I, li I like that. I love people who can get off the back as quick as that and as cool as that. Gagiev has to work hard again to get him down. Mantukivi needs to just throw hands and not legs because he got the leg caught straight into a double. But to be honest, it looks like he's got a body lock and he's going to try a takedown of his own. And this is coming from a striker, Sean. We've been told that he's a superb striker. See the grapevine on the leg. Call for action from our outstanding Polish referee, Łukasz Posadzki. Me and then the counter right hand from Gagiev. See the grinding pressure. 
Antukivi, now turned by Gagiev. Antukivi's working well with a pummel. He'll be happy with the separation as well. Side kick, right hand. Oh, Gagiev, beautiful left hook. The rear teep, nothing there from Antukivi. He needs to be careful to a teep because he's just been taken down from a kick. Right hand from Gagia. Yeah, right on the temple too. Spinning back fist. Got the gloves. Driving through. There's the sprawl this time. That was time. a bit better that time. Oh, nice. Onto mount. Onto half guard. Well done from Bashir Gagia. Trying to base now out of the half guard of Mantukivi. Mantukivi trying to sit up and through. Yeah, Mantukivi doesn't lay still. He worked hard the last time and got straight back up. He's working hard this time. Butterfly guard position now, half butterfly for Mantukivi. 220 remaining round number one. Mantukivi is not allowing him to get his weight on top. Oh, that would have been a roll over the top there if it wasn't for the fence. Gagiev again, hooking the leg of Mantukivi. Quite happy to settle in the guard. Got a spin around for an arm bar, he's going to use that, that rope with his... No, he missed it. Try to grab the rope with his foot so he could spin around, he's got the arm tight. There we go, he's trying... Walking up his guard, Alexei Mantukivi. Agiev, relatively conservative, top position, keeping his head pressed into the chest and the chin of Mantukivi. Mantukivi triangle, got a triangle. Bar. Needs to lock it up, he needs to put his feet the other way around. He's got his ankles crossed, but he's gone back in the guard now. Agiev nicely just posturing, sliding his left shoulder through out of triangle danger. Now, to keep you the very active machine from the bottom. Very active, but, Sean, it doesn't win you the round. You can be as active as if you want on the bottom. It doesn't win you the round. Final minute now, round number one. Riev now passes, but he allows his opponent to stand back up. Matu Kivi is happy with that. Well done for Mantukivi getting back to his feet. On the outside, center of the ring now coming forward. Short right hand, Gagia. Oh. Mantukivi firing right back, yeah, coming Mantuk forward. Mantukivi smelled blood, he went forward there. Now 20 seconds remaining, round number one. Went for the face tape. And that overhand right from Gagiev. Good right hand from Antukivi. Tentative outside kick by Sheer Gagiev. Still the forward pressure. Final stage is round number oh, one. What Uppercut. The cut. They're gone. We are headed to round two. Be sure and download our M1 Global TV app. And go online, m1global.tv. You can watch all of our broadcasts on our mobile app live around the world for free in HD. Gagiev trying to make this an inside fight, stepping forward, landing that right hand on the forehead. Matukivi very active with his bottom game. Gagiev, more about position than about ground and pound from the top in round number one. Slight delay. Lukasz Posaski checking the left glove tape. Bashir Gagiev, now we are set for round number two. Right here in Ingushetia. Oh, Fully nice. behind Gagiev. 
Mantikivi come forward with a beautiful strong leg kick and in the inside Mantikivi trying to establish the jab tentative on that kick kick checked Machine and our fighter meeting Mantukivi talked about high volume of low kicks. We're seeing a few more in round two, but relatively few overall. Well, the first low kick he threw in the round one, Gagaev was strong, he was fast, he wasn't tired, and he caught that leg. Now he's got, oh, there's a nice sprawl. But now he's not, oh, but good, he turned the corner. That was beautiful. Triangle attempt, though. Uh, sorry, guillotine attempt. He's in the right position. He's out, he's out! Technical oh submission! He is out! Lukasz Bosatsky checking the arm. Gagia being put to sleep on the guillotine from Alexei Mankiewi. Great referee in mind, because that wasn't, it didn't seem to be on long enough to put someone to sleep, but he was, he was out. His arm was limp, and that's what you do. You check the arm, that's free. You check the arm, it went limp, and that means he's out. What a great finish. Mantikivi. On the carotids, Bashir Gagiev going out relatively quickly. Second round technical submission win for Alexei Mantukivi, now 11 and 4 in his pro MMA career and 1 and 0 in M1. Did you see the man in charge of M1, the founder of this great promotion, Kadeem yeah, Fengelstein? Night of finishes continues here on One Challenge 86 at Sport Palace in Ingushetia, Russia. Ten fights, eight finishes. Ladies and gentlemen, after one minute, six seconds of round two, we have a winner. Due to referee stoppage to a guillotine, Alexi Mantukivi! I'm here with your champion. What a great finish. Alexi, you said in the VT, in the video, that you're gonna punch him, you're gonna kick him, and you're gonna knock him out. <laughs> you got him with a submission. Was that planned? Was that a game, like, Playing possum, or were you looking for the knockout? Alexei, отличный финиш. В своем видео ты говорил, что ты будешь бить его, ты будешь бить его руками, ногами, и в конце ты его нокаутируешь. Но все-таки ты выиграл удушающим приемом. Был ли это твой план? Yeah, well, everybody wants to go the crown with me, so I have some new tricks there now. Да, все хотят провести бой со мной в партере, поэтому я выучил несколько новых штук. Well, you've proved to the world, you've proved to Russia. You can punch, you can kick, and now you can submit. What is next for you? Да, ты доказал всей России, что ты можешь бить, ты можешь бить руками, ногами, но также и сабмишены твои тоже хорошие. Что дальше для тебя? Some big piece of cake. Большой кусок торта. A funny man also. Ladies and gentlemen, your winner, Alexei Matukivi! Heavily hyped coming into this fight is M1 debut. Showing his skill set, indeed showing his class. Alexei Mantukivi. Gagiev hitting the takedown. Very aggressive with his takedowns. Good body control midair after fishing for the trip. Significant strike, the right hand. Mantukivi trying to work his sprawls. That was a great second effort by Gagiev. But then into the guillotine, the arm goes limp. Great recognition from referee Wukash Bosatsky. Gagiev is out. Put to sleep on the submission via the guillotine. The winner by way of second round technical submission, Alexei Mantukivi defeats Bashir Gagiev.